Hello everybody and welcome to Squad Builder Showdown Uncut. Today I am joined by Reeve. Hello there everyone. And today we're going to be doing a very special edition of Squad Builder Showdown where there's going to be absolutely no cuts in this video or as few cuts as we can possibly manage obviously when we get into the game and these cameras run for 30 minutes at a time and then we'll have to press record again. But we'll be stopping, we'll be explaining everything that we do and you guys will get a little bit of a behind the scenes look at Squab of the Showdown and what goes on in the thinking. We are especially on Discord as well, so we can mute our mics to each other and talk to you guys and tell you what we're thinking and stuff like that. Yeah. So what are you thinking? Be, what, what are you what thinking, thinking right now? Yeah. Right now I'm thinking hurry up and do this intro because these cameras only record for 30 minutes and I need to get it done as fast as I can <laughs> so that we can squash in as much of the video. Okay, so let me know if you guys enjoyed this as well, by the way. It's going to be quite a fair bit longer than normal Squabble of the Showdown, I would imagine, kind of a bit like a podcast. So I might not even bother to like edit it or put any music in it or anything like that, and you guys can just listen to it in the background if you want to do something. I don't know, let me know if you enjoy it. Drop a like if you do. We did another normal Squabble of the Showdown over on Reeves' channel as well, which probably went up sometime last week because I'm currently away at skiing. But enough chitter chatter, Reeve. It's all right for some, yeah? On the Shall on the we slopes. just get in? Oh yeah, it's alright with my skin, innit? Shall we yeah. just get in and get some formations in our Hain and Crespo, as you can see? So, we're going big as well for the first ever Squad Builder Showdown Uncut. We've got ourselves a legend. Very true. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's, let's get some formations. Formation. It's literally just a massive stab in the dark, innit, with formations, really, let's be, let's be honest. It I'm gonna go... Depends how well you know the person. And I'd like to think I know you quite well, my man. You would? Okay. I have ready? mine I have mine. Yes, I am ready. I am ready. Okay. I am going to go for my formation four. A formation I haven't played in a while, but I think it's going to be good for this guy. Four, three, three, four. Okay. Didn't get it. So, apparently I don't, don't know you that well. Yes. Okay. What would you like? I would like the four, one, two, one, two, two. Whereas I know you very, very well, Reeve. You genuinely haven't written that down. Come on, man. I genuinely have. How? What? So, so the four geez. three, the four three one two is open. The four three one two is open. I knew you wouldn't take it because I'm gonna write it down because it's obvious. You go for that one, so change. And then there we go. Boom. Right. What are you gonna give me? Ooh, that's a very good question. Actually, I'm gonna give you four triple two because I played against hashtag Harry. I gave me. He said it was the worst formation on the game. So I'm gonna give it to you now. What does Hashtag Harry know about a FIFA man? Come on. Not much, to be fair. He is pretty yeah. bad. I did smash him on his own channel. <sighs> right. Okay, so that means... Wait, am I going three players now, or...? What's the best way to do it? So we've obviously... I, I've got two wingers is the best way to do it. Should we do your striker and two cams, yeah? And then we'll do my two CD... Your two CDMs with my midfield? Yep, yeah. okay. That's probably the best way to do it, isn't it? Okay. So we can go, we can go absolutely anywhere, Literally, though. Literally everyone. Any, so I mean, we're doing Squad Builder Showdown uncut, so we can show the people what goes on in our head while we're thinking about it. And there's absolutely no point because you can just write anything. Yeah, yeah, pretty much. Yeah. <laughs> well, I wonder what he's gonna pick for. Oh wait, we have. We can literally choose anyone. Oh wait, no, no. Okay. So I'm just gonna have a nose in my club and see what I've got. This is what I usually do on Squad Builder Showdowns. I either there's two two ways I usually go about it. Is either Properly thinking about a sneaky squad beforehand, like if I know in advance who I'm going to be recording on yeah. and who with. Yeah. Jack54 is a bugger for this as well. Yeah. Design the most ludicrous hybrid where there's always four options for every choice, so you can never guess it. it proper does my head in. Or sometimes I'll literally do just wing it and just see what's in my club. Ooh, I could get this guy. I think, I, I think I know who I want. I think I'm, I'm pr pretty sure I know who I want. I don't know who you want. But I, I'm pretty sure I've, I've decided myself. Okay, I'm not going to go with that. I'm going to go. Well, he's got a new picture. That's nice. See, I. This is again. There's just too much choice. There is a lot of choice. Okay. Okay, I know what I'm going to do. I know what I'm going to do now. I just need to write down two of the most random players on this game. If my whiteboard pen would work, that would be absolutely. You've got to write down three for me. Oh, I do. Oh, I'm writing down a left wing. I'm off my head. Okay. Right. I bought Walcott. We don't want to write that on him. So I got to write down a striker for you and two cams. Yeah. Hmm. Who would Andros... Who would Andros use? See, that's, I'm trying to get inside your head, but I'm thinking Royce. It's no good. 
Yeah, Royce I was is... gonna write down Walcott and Royce, but you didn't give me any wide players. That's the problem. Exactly. <sighs> okay, I'm ready if you are, man. I'm almost ready. I'm just trying to think of the final one. Are you gonna go big or are you gonna go home? It, it really doesn't matter, does it? Let's let me have a look. What cams are we going to my club and I'll just bloody write one down. Okay, we're gonna go for this guy. Okay, there you go, Reef. Who? Okay. Who's oh, the I'm most going long and drawn out guesses. When I'm going first. No chance. Go on, yeah. I'm going first. All right. Okay. Um, I I I I heard you say, are you gonna go big or are you gonna go home? But I'm gonna have to put my little testicles on the line here and say SBC Luis Suarez what? Dybala that silence is a bad thing I think you might have run down Dybala and finally I'm going to go with Iniesta as well Jesus Christ <laughs> I put Lacazette the machete Oh, good call. Cool. He was he was rattling in my brain a little, but I didn't end up going with him. So I put Fekir because I just couldn't think of another one because he gets a strong link to him, a perfect link to him. And yeah. then I was literally just flicking through my club looking for a camera right now, Juan Mata. Hello, my name is Juan. Welcome to my squad villa showdown. <laughs> if, if hashtag Harry is correct, then it's completely pointless in me having... If hashtag Harry is correct, you're going to be discarding that Suarez. Yeah, 88, 80. Oh no, he's untradeable as well. No, that's not going to happen. I can't let that happen. All right, now it's your turn. Left wing, I am going for someone that I used in Squad of the Showdown the other day and I absolutely loved. I'm going for a special card. It is this Balde Diaw, so I'm going to rebuy this team of the tournament. I've just realised as well, when we're dropping <sighs> concepts in, we'll just have to buy them at the end. I heard, of you talking about, I heard you talking about him earlier, but it didn't register it. Oh, never mind. Okay. He's very, very, very good. <laughs> Oh no, I've got him, he's just a left forward, brilliant. Okay, he can go in there. And then right wing, I'm gonna keep it Syria then. And I'm gonna go for a right midfielder with five star skills, mesh you up and go for Juan Cuadrado. Ooh, I went Salah, so not far off. Ooh, I was tempted by him, you know, because of his team in the tournament as well. Yeah, I thought you'd go to, well, I thought you'd go an orange Salah. If one of us had got one then, that would've been ridiculous. Yeah, <laughs> out of all the choices. Ah, <sighs> right, okay. Right, what we usually do then is just, this is just for the people you obviously know what we usually do. You've got Crespo is left striker. He is indeed, yeah. Good guess. Suarez is right. Yeah. That puts Iniesta behind him. I'm just filling in on foothead. And blood, is it the centre forward 89 rated die baller? 88. 88. Cam. Cam. Straight cam. Yeah. That is a lot of stuff for me to be discarding, Reef. Yeah. Oh, it's, it's not going to get to that situation, man. Don't worry about it. Okay, so two CDMs for you, two strong links, one's a legend. Yeah, it's not too bad. I mean, yeah. Okay, okay, in fact, I'm gonna, I'm gonna mute Mike. I'm sure a lot of people play along with Squabbler Showdown, but... Yeah, the, yeah. <laughs> and they already know the thought process and stuff like that. But I'm gonna mute my mic and I'm gonna tell the people what I'm thinking now, basically, right. is Reef can't don't worry. He's obviously got okay. to... Crespo's fine. Suarez is fine. Crespo links to everyone mm. anyway. But you can put... He needs, like, either a Spanish player in the Syria to link Dybala to Iniesta or a Argentinian in the Liga BBVA. And I think he's going to go Argentinian in Liga BBVA because of that Perez. And also, there's there's a couple of others as well. Let me have a little look. I've realised that if I mute mine, then... Uh... There's no way of us communicating, even if I can't hear you. <laughs> I can't still hear you. See, there's this Perez guy here. Dear, oh dear. And then there's this Fernandez guy as well. He's not particularly good at defending. Is there a CDM? I mean, he could, oh, he could go in Zonzi and con dog beer as well, though. There's Escalante. He's pretty terrible. I'm going to put two. I'm going to go all my eggs in one basket. I'm going to go in Zonzi to con dog beer. So right down in Zonzi. And I'm gonna go Perez to like Benega or someone like that. Not Ben. What? It is Benega, is he? Is that actually a good idea? Is he really mm -hmm. gonna do that? Well, if you can hear me, my man, I'm ready. Oh, Biglia, sorry, Biglia, I was thinking of. Okay. Yeah, I am ready as well, so let's unmute Reeve. Okay, okay, I've told them I think I'm Reeve. You have? Who would you like? Let's see if I'm right. You've told them your thinking. My logic. Okay, right. I. I'm going to go with a delicious 
pairing in Casemiro as one of my DMs. Yeah. You sound quite pleased about that, so I think you've already written them down. And, and I, I, I'm, I could be walking into a trap here, but I do want to kind of go for another Brazilian. Um, I think I think I'm safe in going with. <laughs> I don't know anymore, man. I'm gonna go. Yeah, I'm gonna go with Luis Gustavo. Good choices. I didn't even think of that one, so I thought we'd either go Argentinian with that. Remember Perez from FIFA like 15, and he was incredible. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Valencia across the Biglia. Yeah. And then oh. my other one was in Zonzi to Condogbia. But you okay. went Casemiro to... I guessed Alan when you said it, but I was wrong anyway. Okay, okay. Right, now it's your turn. Shoes on the other foot. It is my turn. And I was too busy writing down or explaining to the people what I wanted myself. To, what I thought you wanted, sorry, to even think about what I wanted for myself. Yeah. So now I'm thinking, Balde Diaw. Surely I've got to put just a guy in. But then I'm thinking, is that an absolutely terrible idea? Wait, how does it... Oh, they, oh, they're the same country. Ah, shut up, Reeve. I'm not falling for this, okay? <laughs> I am gonna go for... Oh, this is actually this is actually troubling me. Mostly just because I haven't thought about it at all. I'm gonna whack in my boy, Kevin De Bruyne. Okay. I don't know if that's a stupid idea, actually. Oh, no, no, we're good. Are we good? I don't know if we are good. We might then... Try and wing this down to check Kuyate instead of Idrissa Guy. Interesting. Good little player. I think I might have messed myself up here, you know. Okay, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna mute away from Reeve. Who Oh my controller's just died, are you kidding? This is not going well. This is really not going well. What I'm thinking is nine golden, obviously. But then is nine golden just a stupidly obvious pick? For someone to say just because I've got Syria players. So now I'm thinking, is there a way to get a strong link to I could get Danny Alves gets a strong link to Quadrado, but then if I put Fernandinho there, that's just so stupidly obvious, isn't it? I think I might just have to go for it and just put a nine goal in it. Okay. I'm I'm just gonna I'm just gonna put my life on the line, Reeve, and I'm just gonna say nine goal. Have you muted yourself again? You just cut out. No, I unmuted myself. I'm going to put my life on the line and go nine golden. Okay. Wait, so who did you say? Czech Criate, Kevin De Bruyne, okay. nine golden. Well, you can have two of them. Do you have one has a guess at which one you can't have? I reckon I can't have Criate. I reckon you might have written down Idrissa Guy and Criate. You can't have nine golden. Oh, fuck. For... God's sake. Marquisio, nine golden, and Idrissa Guy. I knew you'd throw that address again. I knew you were trying to bull off me. Is there another yeah. Belgian in the Calcio Serie A that I could have used? There is. Comes. No. Oh, dear, he's, oh dear. He's come a bit late, hasn't he? <laughs> Brilliant. <sighs> right. So therefore, I have to pick you a player. Who, what, <laughs> position, what position are we looking at here? Right, right central center. midfield. Okay. Um, Ideally, a Belgian Calcio A player would be beautiful for my chemistry. I mean, yeah. Well, uh, okay. <coughs> I can give you a Belgian. Can I give you a Calcio Belgian? Are there even any other than Nine Golden? It's loads. There isn't a goalie, but there is. Some other pretty awful ones. Hmm. Oh, there's cool. even a bronze cap. Is there? Yeah. Wait, wait, where are you looking? What's his name? Oh, Bastion. Bastion. Yeah, you can have Bastion actually. I'm not going to use my trump code just yet. You're a nice guy, if You are a nice guy. Absolutely. Not my pleasure, but. Just a gentleman. Yeah. Okay, so. You've got Casemiro on the right hand side. I have indeed. Doing it with a legend makes it well odds. Did you pick his man of the match? Oh uh, no, just his inform. Just his first inform. Okay, 
and Luis Gustavo. Wait, from the Bundesliga? Indeed. Indeed, indeed. Mm. Okay, so he's going to need a strong link from his centre back, isn't he? He is indeed. What on earth are you doing here? Because Dybala needs at least one more link. Yeah, Dybala is fine, so long. He can have a weak or a strong. But yeah. if it's a weak, then the left back needs a weak link to the centre back as well. This is interesting. Is there any Argentinian? I shouldn't. I shouldn't be saying this to you. What is going on? See, I could actually just say this to you and just totally put your offers on. Could do. It's up to you, man. Do what you want. Hmm. So you either go. Who are the strong links to Gustavo first of all? Let's let's address this question. Strong links to Luis Gustavo are at centre back. Naldo, Bruma, Roger, Anderson, and all these are ones are absolutely terrible. So most of them are Brazilian. So let's just pretend that you have Naldo there. You could go for a Brazilian Syria centre left back. Are you trying to psych yourself out here? I don't know if I'm trying to psych myself out or I'm trying to psych you out. <laughs> meanwhile, cool. meanwhile, I'm just going to work out all of your players. So. Yeah. So, and then right back. You can just do whatever you want really, can't you? Uh, yeah, pretty much. But I think you're going to go... Oh. Let me have a look, let me have a look, let me have a have, look. Have a, have a, yeah, take your time, man. No problem. I think you're gonna him. I'm gonna show the people my guesses once I've spelled this guy's name. There you go, they are my guesses. That's what I think Reeve is gonna do. Do all you guys are guessing along with. Do you wanna, do you wanna explain to people what your thought process is, Reeve, while I work out what the as in, as in my for, own squad? As in for you, as in for your team, yeah, see what... Right, what so... As we know, ladies and gentlemen, Andy likes to spice things up a little in every place. Wait, are you are you know. deliberately bluffing me or have you forgot to mute your mic? No, I'm... I'm, I'm whether, or, whether or not this is intentional, mate, you'll have to find out. <laughs> okay, brilliant. So, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to keep intermittently muting my mic so you can't hear me. <laughs> okay, so left back, ladies and gentlemen. I've chosen... A person. My <laughs> this is so <laughs> a person who fulfills both, as it's Senegalese left back positions. I think he's the only person from the Premier League that gives Kuyate a strong link in that position. And he gives mm. Bolde Dio a strong, no, Bolde Dio a normal link. So he's from Senegal. Okay, right, so we've got, we've got our left back. If Andy doesn't pick this, I'll be highly disappointed. And then at right back, he has very many options, but who would he go for? What right back would Andros go for? I think he's going to have to pick a Serie A right back. Whether or not he'll pick Lichsteiner, I don't think so. He could pick Danny Alves. Okay, now we have a bit of a problem. He has many options at right back, but... Ooh! Danny Alves or Abate? Because I don't think he'll pick Florenzi. And having said that, he probably will pick Florenzi. But I'm going to go with Abate in the hope that he thinks that I've picked someone big for him. But in reality, he doesn't actually pick somebody big. Right, I'm going to unmute my mic now. Okay. I'm back! Okay, are you ready? I am ready. Okay. Would you like to go first or second? I would like to go second. Okay, so for my left back, I've backed myself into a bit of a, my love of Adrissa Guy has just ruined me because I didn't even end up using Adrissa Guy. And yeah, I'm screwed basically. I've been trying to work out all different ways to do it. I can't use a, I need a link to Cuyote at all times, otherwise basically, like I can't use a strong link for Lazio because then I need a strong link to Ocbonna and it doesn't work because I'm not going to link to the left back and it's all just all over the place. So basically, I, the only thing I can do is Senegalese. So there's two options, well there's three options. 
One, this one would involve needing another Senegalese player at centre-back, and the only really good one, I think, is Koulibaly, so we won't do that because that's very obvious. Then we've got Drame or Suare. So it's basically a 50-50 punt, I reckon. I'm going to go for the one that leaves more options open to me because it totally closes off the left-hand side and everyone's full chem already, whereas with this dude, I'd need more links to Kuyate. So I'm going to go for Suare. Okay. And then right back, I just need a Calcio A right back, which is more, should be very, very easy to pick up one that you haven't written down. Do any of them get strong links? No. Oh, uh, Lichsteiner gets a strong link. I'll go for Lichsteiner. Oh, you gotta be kidding. I literally said when I was telling them he won't pick Lichsteiner, so I'll just look beyond him. I thought you might have picked Danny Alves in reality, because Danny Alves is a much better version than Nick Steiner. I'm thinking options. Okay, he plays for the same club. I'm, I'm thinking yeah. options. I just don't have Danny Alves in my club. But I did write down, I wrote down a Barty as opposed to Lichsteiner. But I did write down Suarez, so oh. you can't have your left foot. I'm really not good at scoring the showdown on the fly. <laughs> that's what I did. That's what I literally was doing for my one. I was just making up as I go. Right. Let's look for a Senegalese left back. Hmm. Just to make your life even harder and give you even less options. Oh, dearie, dearie me. Actually, draw me. Wait. Draw me would have given you. Yeah, I was told. He, yeah, but I'd still need a link to Kuyate. Ah, yeah, yeah you're correct. You're correct. So far, I go Suare and I can do whatever I want. But in hindsight, um, yeah. I mean, I'm gonna give you Mamadou Ndi and die. N D I A Y E. This dude. Yeah. Don't have the 66 pace. Yes. Brilliant. Cheers, mate. What league is he from? He is from. League. He's got the French League, that's Montpellier, isn't it? It is indeed. French League. Okay, let's see what sort of a hybrid we can come up with this. None, because I still need a link to Cuyarte. Cheers, Reeve. Yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> um. Wait, so does that mean I've got to put a Senegalese centre back? It does, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Literally, yes. <laughs> Literally. Okay. Yes. Right, now it's my turn to. Enter the firing squad. Uh, oh, just rubbed out my guesses. Oh, no, what did I write down? One sec. <laughs> okay, I remember. I remember. Hey, see how much harder it is than there's eyes watching you at all times. I know, but I don't just get to stop and think. I've still got to be talking and stuff as well. Um, I wrote down that. Okay. Go on. Right. Um, I think you might have written down Ansaldi. Or Garcia. Which one do I go for? I think I'm going to go with... I'm going to go with Vangioni. Okay. I thought I'd done you then with the man games, talking about the Argentinians. And you were going to go for Alexandro, but you didn't. Okay. Right, I'm gonna, yeah. So, Dybala and Vangioni are completely sorted. And at right back, I can go with literally anyone here. But this actually seems harder than <laughs> picking the left back. Um, I'm going to go with... Now, if I had squad budget challenge one friend, I'd really love to pick him in this situation. There's also quite a lot of players that are very good in this situation. But I'm going to go with DeMarcos. Danilo. Okie dokie. You have snaked me. Snaked you very nicely there. Right. Now, as they say, the final hurdle, mate. Do you have Scrub of the Challenge to Marcos? No, I don't. I don't. I just have the normal one. I okay. really wish I did. So you got Vangioni is sorted. The Marcos is sorted. You need a strong link to Gustavo and a link of some sort to Casemiro. Yeah. Yeah. See, the logical thing to do for you then is just, well, most of Gustavo's strong links are Brazilian anyway. Yeah, pretty much. Just pick a Brazilian one. Throw a Brazilian underneath Casemiro, laughing. I mean, I could do that. So now the question is, do I write down? Horribly easy, right? 
two Brazilian strong links in Naldo and Reese. Is he muted? I'm going to check Discord. Yes. <laughs> That's what I think I'm going to do. I'm going to write down that Reese dude. But then is hmm. see the problem with Naldo is Reeves going to think that Naldo is we so obvious. We enter a predicament, obvious. ladies and gentlemen. So obvious that he's not going to. I'm, I'm not going to write it, but he's not going to pick it. But then do I write it? Because then he might think it's obvious that I won't write it and he should pick it. Or does he go Bruma and pick a Dutch centre-back? All the others are kind of terrible. Roger has got no pace. Bruma hasn't really got any pace, but he's got more than Roger. What other Dutch centre-backs is there? None of them get a link. To Casemiro, so surely we can write that off. Surely, because then he puts Bruma there. Just sit here twiddling my thumbs. And bit, he, could go, he could go Sergio Ramos oh, how at, I at right centre back. Because then that's a pair. A link to Demarcos, a link to Casemiro. He's on full chem. Bruma gets a strong link to Gustavo, what? and then you put the goalkeeper from Wolfsburg. So let me write down the goalie from Wolfsburg as well, just to make sure he can't do that. So that was, of course, Benaglio. It's a sneaky tactic. I don't know if he's going to be clever enough to think about that. that sometimes when you're doing Scott of the Showdown, just the simple way is the way to go. Because people don't think about it so crazily. So we've got uh, Rice down. I don't we got one Bruma doing. down. I'll show you the ones, that I'm, the ones that I'm looking at. We've got Brazilian. Myself in the Bundesliga centre-backs. So I've got... I was looking at this Roger, but he's not very good. I've got this dude down because he's pacey. We could go Alderson or Naldo. I'm just going to write down Naldo. I'm just going to write down Naldo. YOLO. Hello, Reef. Hi. I'm struggling. I'm struggling as well. This is ruined my squad. This is possibly the longest amount of time I've spent. I'm sorry. I need a Senegalese centre back, is my problem. Yeah, well, I, I mean, I, I did realise that. Oh, this could work. Okay, let me test this out. Because then I need... These are going to be terrible, isn't he? Um... Um... <laughs> that's just all I'm saying at the moment. Oh, it's me again. Good ones at all, <laughs> are you kidding me? See, because that links, then you get a strong link with him. Yeah, I mean, I don't know what you're on about, but sure. I might have to do that, because is there any other way? Is there any other, other than obviously way? playing Cool of Ali here, which is just far too obvious? Do I go for it? See, just slap Cool of Ali there, and all my problems are solved. What are you thinking, Reeve? Uh, uh, well, I'm too busy struggling with my own to actually bothered about <laughs> thinking of yours. Absolutely done me up a treat. No problem. Ooh, anytime. Hang on. Anytime, man. Anytime. Get... Ooh. Ooh, this could work, this could work. Then we bring in... <clears throat> See, I'm gonna, I'm gonna mute my mic one sec. So I found a strong <laughs> link to my left back from He's gone again. another Senegalese from the Ligue 1, which then means if I can bring in a French Calcio A centre-back, such as De Mayo, it's not the best, but I mean, it's better than getting my players guessed. Oh, we'll go for Hertau, we'll go for Hertau. Oh, no, because he doesn't get a strong link. Oh, I need to do a... Sh we need a strong link to one of these two. To Lichsteiner or... Oh, dear, oh, dear. Oh, dear. This dude's called. Dear, oh, dear, oh, she dear, needs oh, to dear. play for... Chivio Verona or Juve. Brilliant. Okay, let, let me have a look. Let me have a look. So they have got... Absolutely terrible centre-back. So we're going for a Juve one. And then that means we then need the all Italian apart from Benatia's Moroccan. So if this is going to work, we need an Italian or Moroccan goalkeeper from the Ligue 1. Otherwise, I'm screwed. Ligue 1, goalkeeper. 
Is there an Italian one? There used to be. There is. The Sanctus is still there. Okay. That's what we're gonna. That's what we're gonna do. That is what we're gonna do. So my camera's just stopped recording, so I'll flip that straight back on. Your camera just stopped recording, Reef. Literally, yeah. <laughs> Are you ready? I'm ready. I'm not ready. I mean, I haven't thought of anything I'm about to do. So. Okay, I've got my guesses for you, and I think I've worked out a way to do my team. Really? Yeah. I'm doing well, mate. Yeah, but are you though? No, I mean I've got two bronzes, <laughs> but I think I'm yeah. just gonna do I'm gonna do this and then uh... <laughs> this is I this is what I, usually I'm... happens in Squabble the Showdown. Is he just yeah, sitting here like but, hmm, yeah? We just ooh, we have to cut it though. <laughs> yeah, but it just gets cut. Does just get cut. I think we've done quite a good job of not making this episode stupidly long though. Because usually we talk for 10 minutes on each position and stuff like about what we're gonna do and have no talking at all in the middle, like in the gaps I was thinking, and then we chop the no talking out, but we still end up with 40 minutes of talking or whatever. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's Whereas true. Now, I mean, we have, we have just hit 30 minutes of it's, solid. It's oh, no, a, wait. It, Scrub of the Showdown episodes are 20 minutes long, aren't they? I'm talking yeah. absolute rubbish. This is well it's long. A, it's, yeah, it's, it's quite long. Um, it's very long. Have you finished, then? Uh, no, I just need to put a keeper down for you, I think. Um, if you get me, you will properly get me. But if you don't get me, I've done well, obviously. All right. You know. Well, I think, I think I'm ready if you're ready. Okay, I'm gonna go first then because I think I've been well sneaky here. Alright. So, I have found a Senegalese centre back who isn't Koulibaly, who gets a strong link to the. Well, there was another route I was gonna go down there, I'll tell you about. It was this Imboji guy who plays in the Pro League and they put a Belgian Pro League centre back next to him to get a link to that guy that he gave me instead of Nine Golden. But anyway, we're not gonna do that. We're gonna go for. Where's he gone? Where's he gone? This Diagonal guy because he gets a strong link to my left back. Plays in the Ligue okay. 1. We're right. going to drop in a Ligue 1 goalkeeper who is Italian and his name is the Sanctis. Alright. And then we're going to jump across to get a strong link to Lichsteiner with an Italian from the Calcio A whose name is. Let me just see which one of them I've got in my club. Barzagli. Oh, very nice. Yeah, you can have all three, mate. Sorted myself out proper there, I. That's that's really quite frustrating. What you put? I put Gillabodji, who yeah. plays for Sunder Sunderland. Uh, Kudabali, because I wanted two bullets. Well, I, I can't, I couldn't let you have him just in case you're trying to play me. Uh, and then I put Courtois just because I didn't really work out anything beyond that. Fair. <laughs> who would you like? Well, now it's my turn. You're in a bit of a pickle as well. I am in a bit of a pickle. Now here's hoping, here's hoping that you have. Written down a trio of Brazilians for me, and I can get away with having Sergio Ramos in this team. You can, and that was something that I did say that if you plonk Sergio Ramos there, then it gets a strong link to the Marcos and a strong link to Casemiro. And I should have just wrote it because I knew you were going to do it, but I still put all my eggs in the other basket. Uh, and then I've backed myself into a corner, but I'm going to go down fighting anyway. You almost definitely have written Naldo, but I'm going to pick him anyway. Okay. And in goal, I am also going... Oh, actually, can I get... Wait, who can I have here? I can have quite a, a number of people here, actually. Oh, can I try him? I mean, I could go Diego Alves here, in reality, but I'm pretty sure you might have written him down, so I'm going to go no, for him. Oh, yeah. No, you can't. Yeah, can. Okay. You can't. Why? Because Naldo needs another strong link. Oh, okay. No, I can't. Oh, I thought Naldo was still at Wolfsburg. That's my bad. I've got a little confused there, but I'm going to go with Farman then. Yeah, you can have them. I put Benaglio in case you went for Bruma, then Benaglio. That would have worked as well next to Ramos. Yes! Wait, I hang up. I got away with a full team there. Nah, I got Naldo. Oh, okay. <laughs> so, 
I do have my trump cards as well, actually, don't I? Because you guessed loads of my players. In fact, you guessed yeah. two. I've guessed one. That's not too bad. Yeah. So I am going to give you, Reed, a Bundesliga goalkeeper, obviously. It's going to be... I don't know why I'm looking in my own club. Have I got any bronzes that I've used before? Oh, I could give you... Yes, we're going to give you him. We're going to give you the one and only Ryman. It has to be Brazilian, though, doesn't it? God, he does. He has to get a link to Naldo. What a pain in the bum. <sighs> Just dodged a legend. <laughs> Wait, there isn't a Brazilian Bundesliga goalkeeper. Is there Wait, a hang on. Oh, no, it's a centre-back, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, but there isn't a Brazilian Bundesliga goalkeeper. Oh, man. Yeah, but you can put anything other... Anything else there, Oh wait, no, he's not gonna get any he's getting no chemistry anyway, he just needs a strong link to Gustavo, doesn't he? Uh yeah. You're getting me all confused. Well and farming, but wait, I don't think that works. Yeah, such as Castiles. Oh no, he's Belgian. Oh yeah. Oh no, I've got a set of gold. Give me a sec, give me a sec. Wait. Yeah, there you go. You can have Grun. That works. Just, well, how 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 do I spell that? G R crazy German U N. Okay. Concert players. Max Grun. Oh, perfect! Cheers, mate! See, I'm just a nice guy, aren't I? Oh, he's actually up. A sweet 450 coins. Oh, yeah. How tall is he? He's six foot three. Is this the curse of the tall goalkeeper again? We shall see. I am actually going to put a cut in this video. In fact, I probably will edit the gameplay, otherwise, it'll just be well boring just watching us play FIFA for ages. So, yeah. I'll edit the gameplay. I hope you guys have enjoyed this crazy little podcasty style squabble the showdown. If you have, like I said, smash a like and let me know and I can do some more of them. They're really, really easy to make, especially because Ed and Squabble the Showdown takes ages and it doesn't really take any editing. We just have to record it, which is good. But yeah, let's actually have a cut. Let's buy these players and let's jump into a game. Here, oh my god, that is a lot of special cards. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Here we go. Yeah, it's pretty good, isn't it? If Brun lets you down, lets me score loads. Whoa, how old does Iniesta look in his new picture? How what? How old does Iniesta look? He looks like a 50-year-old H3H3. Yeah, I packed him this morning. Very nice, very yeah, nice. New... Referee. Are you joking me? <laughs> Are you having a bubble ref? Oh my God, you're gonna score. You've got to be kidding me. Oh my Get God. Get in! Oh! Her nan! Who's nan? Her nan. The ref's nan, probably. The way he's favouring you. <laughs> well, half time. And we've gone from uncut to basically having one highlight to put in the game. Yeah, yeah literally. 40 minutes of talking to like nothing. Oh, okay. Do you know what I've just noticed? Ramos and Grun have got the same boots on it. They've properly yeah, they look. Yeah, they look. They look exactly the same. I've literally been like, how the fuck has Ramos been everywhere? But obviously some of the occasions it's been. What, that one's grunt. There's friggin' Ramos. We've done him. That's a foul ref. Oh my god, this ref hates me. <laughs> that one I actually did concede a little. I was like, how? Okay, what am I doing? Oh yeah, but that's a foul in a nice <laughs> one. Go on. Please be grunt. It is grunt. He's tackled me anyway because I'm too busy looking at who it is. Why is no one in the box? Oh my god, the odds. Yes! Oh my! How is that going? <laughs> that is ridiculous. <sighs> oh, the jam. 87th minute corner. Gotta get your head on that. Oh, yes, Kuyate. Get out to Grun. Long shot. <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> that would have been <laughs> broken. Well, uh, okay. there we go then. From right. 40 minutes of Chitta Chara Squad Villa Shodangan to. A lot of long shots from Reeve, and not much else, really. Hang about. You, you had 11 okay. shots, but like I'm counting at least six of them outside the box there. You did have a couple of decent chances. I had absolutely nothing. I mean, yeah. the real winners here have just been the people who wanted to see what went on behind the scenes of Squabble the Shadow. That's very true. So yeah. Nobody's is... lost anything. My multicoloured rainbow team survives another day. Woo! Hey, considering, considering I had a 4 triple 2 there, I think I came off the back of that pretty well. Mm. Hashtag Harry said it was rubbish. Did and I've good, just mate. drawn. Yeah, Did thank you. Pretty good. But yeah, my team wasn't the best. There it is. This guy was terrible. This guy was terrible. This guy, Diagne, was sick. Yeah, you, literally man of the match, that Diagne guy. You 
had a bronze, but it didn't really affect you because... Oh no, he was a silver. Oh, he, he was a silver. Oh, he was, he was a goalie though, wasn't he? He had a trump yeah. card, but I couldn't tell which one was him and which one was Ramos. So I had to pretend it was Ramos at all times and couldn't just run past them. So, yeah. yeah, it was a hard game. It was a good game. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. If you have, make sure you smash that like. Let me know if you'd like to see more Squad Battle Showdowns like this in the future. For now, though, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Adios.